You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live every week. Turn on notifications to never miss an episode. Now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, hey, plumbing pros. Welcome to the 321st episode of Potty Talk Live. Hey there, I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber, mm -hmm. along with my co-host, the lovely Laura, where we're talking the business of plumbing, how to systemize, stylize, and most importantly, monetize your plumbing business. Mm -hmm. All right, hey, we have a great episode lined up for you. It's our fifth part of our five-part series, Yes, last Living mm -hmm. an Intentional Life. There we go. Mm -hmm. All right. And okay. this is, we. I think the, the title is what? Caution. A warning. 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 Mm -hmm. Where, Robinson, you remember that back in the, okay, that's dating <laughs> no, us. I don't remember all right. that at all. Warning. <laughs> Mature content. All right. We'll get, get into what that's about here. So it's going to be okay. a fun one. Mm -hmm. So guys, stick around here. But hey, yes. it's great having you here. Hey, hey if you're watching live, you're part of the live social audience, mm -hmm. please type live. Let us know that you're watching with us. Hey, Sarah. All Sarah right. Sarah Haney's in the house. Good to have you here. If you Hey, Sarah. if you're watching the replay, please type replay. Let us mm -hmm. know you caught it. And if you're listening to the podcast, you know what to do. Mm -hmm. Just just keep on listening. All right. Hey, there we go. Hey, Happy I would just we just hey, yes. okay. hey we were just what? having dinner. Yes. In fact, even before we came in here, I mm -hmm. still was watching it. We were watching <laughs> Top Gun. You guys oh, remember that? Hold on, Matt Delaney live from the hot tub. Live from the hot tub. All right, that's the way to uh. that's the way to watch. I hope you have a also a you know glass of wine mm -hmm. or. Or maybe some scotch or whatever. Hey, Cleet hey, Cleet. from Down yeah. Under. How hey, are welcome, you? welcome, mate. How's Australia, mate? All right, welcome. I you're in major lockdown. Yes. All right, Miss <laughs> Nikki. Nikki. All right. Hey, Nikki. All right, good to have you here. <laughs> Speaking of that. Speaking. Yeah, I want to welcome a new producer we to do. Potty Talk Live. We have a brand new producer. All right. Miss mm -hmm. Shelby. Miss Shelby. All right. So everybody say hi to Miss Shelby. Miss Shelby. We are so upgrading jerseys. Hey, Bob Ryan. Hey, Bob. All right. Welcome, brother. We are upgrading our um, our studio and our, our system that we use, and so we've got an expert in a more high-tech uh, kind of thing. Right. She's going to be... Um, taking us into the 21st century. There we go. So right? thank you, Miss Shelby. Yeah. So everybody say hi to Miss Shelby. Us. Super right. excited to have her part of the team. Yes. So. So this is the first night here this is working our first everything. Night. So, so live from the kitchen. Yes. <laughs> All right. Yeah, All right. you do. And, yeah. and and they're in the hot tub. You're in the kitchen. Something right, is right, wrong right. with this picture. Uh, uh, but anyway, Shelby, we're glad to have you on. Yes. So yes, we just kind of. Threw her in um, the mix and said, yeah, she's an expert. She'll yeah, figure it out. She, yeah, so, so, so far, so good. There we go. <laughs> if you guys can hear us and see us, then <laughs> she's a success as far yes. as I'm concerned. But uh, mm -hmm. some good stuff happening behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. right? Howdy, hey, Copeland's. Miss Kathy. <gasps> With the brand new um, branding. Yes. Copeland's out of San Antonio, Texas. Roadrunner Plumbing. Yes, super excited. Yes. To see, um, to see all those trucks on the road. Yes. So, Shelby for the win. Yes, you're there right. We go. Thanks, Anne. Yeah, so, baby. Well, I was watching some Top Gun. Oh, that's just fun. <laughs> Throw back, you know, these crazy times. I just miss just cool. Cool movies. You know, when guys are guys, mm -hmm. girls are girls. Mm -hmm. You know, and. Pilots were pilots. Right. Life, what a burger <laughs> All right. Drive Aaron. Okay, Aaron. Hello. Okay. Did you not watch okay. Module 12? What are we talking about? There's a there? video in there that you should have been, you should have watched. Right. You should be, unless you're getting a salad at Whataburger. Yep. I'm thinking he's not. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, Patrick Vicini, he's back. He's back. Patrick. Life can go on. There we go. Now yes. we can continue. Now all is right with the world. Patrick That's right. Patrick Vicinga. Everybody right. loves us and Patrick Vicinga. Anyway, so you were watching Top Gun. Yes. Yes, you caught a little bit of that. Um, it was just kind of fun. Mm -hmm. Danger zone. You know, <laughs> well, I, I have a history. Oh, I, my stars. I'm not going to tell, but it's just got like story. it. And I, I bought, I bought it because we had the video, but I bought it because mm. my artwork is in the movie. That's true. I was actually spent some time there mm -hmm. when in they Myanmar? were when yes when mm -hmm. they were filming it. I was an air traffic yes. controller. Yeah, you're I was right. Talking. I was an air traffic controller, yes. mm -hmm. and so and so his artwork is in it. These yeah. days, you would have gotten a mention, I think, in all the credits. because yeah, because they run then, all the right of everything. Yeah. But back then, it, not so much. I, I didn't. I didn't get no. any mention. But he, is, he is world famous in okay. Top Gun. Him and Tom Cruise are like that. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. All right. MDP for life. There we go. Daniel. But it, but it was pretty cool. There's so much wrong with the movie. I mean, it's fun. <laughs> um, but there's so much wrong mm -hmm. with, with the movie. Um, but, <laughs> it, but it wasn't meant for movie. that. It was a movie. It's a movie. But you know, yes. one of the things, you know the only 
medal that an officer can't get that an enlisted man can? What? Sorry. What? I was okay. reading Aaron's thing. Sorry. Okay. He's gonna, he needs oh, gonna a three meat three meat burger, burger bin one, one of those days. days. Okay. Every okay. once in a while it is. But at least it's okay. not like hard alcohol. That's right. So <laughs> I guess that's all right. Anyway, okay. what? But the only medal mm -hmm. that an officer cannot get yes. that an enlisted man can get. Okay. All right. Yep. Is the good conduct medal. Oh. Because okay. it's expected that officers are supposed to have good conduct. Good conduct. Okay. Right. Well, there you go. Okay. A so a little bit of trivia there for you. Trivia. Okay. No. Oh, worthless trivia. <laughs> Thanks, babe. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, it's riveting. It's riveting. You're telling swear. me to get to the point here? <laughs> I know. I'm just, I'm just reliving the days here. You know, with the 80, 80s music, you know. And, ABV, I saw you. You know? Yes. All right. It was just fun. Fun. old 80s music. Yeah. Yeah. And the hair. And now I know the hey, hair. Hey, Joe. Right. Got to see Joe and his beautiful wife, Melissa. Yes. His Great time. Got to have, have dinner with them. Yes. Very fun. Carol about how he's taken over his area of Minnesota. Minnesota. Yep. Minnesota. Doing a great job. Yes. All right. Pushing forward. Mm -hmm. So there we go. Okay. All right. So we're... Uh, you want to remind oh. us? <laughs> She's already See, doing already. it. Yes. The producer's got... Right. Sign up for text good. messages. Right. Type text in the comments below so you never miss an episode of Potty Talk Live. Um, easiest way to do it right there. Text. There we go. You text never want to miss an episode or what? Gonna die. That's right. Mm -hmm. Hey, and I think at this point be. too, because yes. we're gonna get into this and probably get to talking or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, I got something for you. Mm -hmm. Let me let me give my, my my freebie giveaway here for you. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. That's my million dollar plumber blueprint. P. All right. Press P. There we go. <laughs> <Yeah>. Okay. <laughs> She's and my good. blueprint there. Mm -hmm. Everything you need to know. All right, to grow a successful, self-sustaining, and profitable plumbing business. Mm -hmm. Hey, you wouldn't plumb a home or a house or a building or whatever without a blueprint, right? Mm -hmm. So. How can you do one, you know, how can you build your business? Okay, you need, you need to plan. know, all right? I lay out mm -hmm. all the specs you need to know, all right, to build your plumbing business. Mm -hmm. And it's free, okay? No strings attached, it's free. Mm -hmm. All right, simply type free in the comments or go to themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash free to mm -hmm. grab your free copy today, okay? Oh, all right? I don't think I've ever sneezed on air, but it's might come. Oh, you got to sneeze? It might happen, yes. Huh. Uh. So who's, in, okay. who's a Minnesota in Northwest Minnesota? Okay, I don't know Minnesota very well, but um, let's see. The Jordans are there as well as... Um, in Mankato. Mankato. Okay, yeah, okay that, which is, I think is more southern. It's mm -hmm. south of um, Minneapolis. Sure. And then... Um, Joe Bates. Joe Bates. Is in... Northern Air Plumbing. We got, uh, mm -hmm. we got Bay Plumbing in... Yeah, Bay Plumbing in, in, in Mankato. Mankato. Yes. Okay, and then Northern Air Plumbing. In... Oh. Shoot, Joe. Okay, wait. Joe. And some real cold place <laughs> in, in Minnesota. Minnesota. <laughs> that does not narrow it down. So right. there's that. Sorry, Joe. I thought, really love, I love, you know, we, we talk about, you know, why we're doing our plumbing businesses and what we're going to do with it and that kind of thing. I just loved what, you know, what they're looking to do. I loved um, his wife. Uh -huh. Well, what she wants to do is what we're yes. is getting her pilot's license. Yes. That, that's a good You know, yeah. and doing that kind of, which mm -hmm. is, I love that for Thinking being. outside I mean, the box. Right. Yes. They have plans. Yes. Yes. Which, so, is, which is cool. It's fun to hear yep. about. Anywho. So. Yes. Oh, so there we go. Okay. All right. We talk well, this is our, the fifth part yes. of our, we're, we're wrapping series. up our, our five-part series, mm -hmm. Living an Intentional Life. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, you know, we, you know that we're all about part of, the, you know, of living an intentional life is, mm -hmm. is taking care of our health. You know, yes. having a healthy life, um, which maybe a burger or whatever doesn't <laughs> Sorry, Aaron. Quite qualify. Hey, but you have those days. Mm -hmm. Hey, okay. We, we had five guys. Right. Oh, we Who had. It, we had. What was it last? What was it? I don't know. We, 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 we got ago. a whole new um, <laughs> a marketing team, which we're really excited about. We really stepped the top shelf. I mean, stuff that we're doing yes. is some of the big names you hear in social media that mm -hmm. using that kind of stuff. Yes. But it comes with a lot of work. Mm -hmm. We thought we were done working. I mean, this is all fun <laughs> for us. But now we got They're work. really stressing so, us. So yeah. They're making us very uncomfortable. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's very. <laughs> I hate being uncomfortable. I know it's stupid. I was just getting comfortable. <laughs> being, you know, we were coasting. We were very comfortable right. being comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> All right, a little inside joke there for, okay. for okay. our okay. clients. All right, yes. but it's just so yeah. We had one of those days we were mm -hmm. done. And we door dashed five guys. We, door we didn't even go out and get it. We didn't even spend energy. <laughs> we didn't leave the couch. <laughs> oh, we just know. aired some dirty laundry. Right. Oh, it was oh, so good. Oh, man, just good. a fat lady, you know. Oh, it was delicious. We had to do an extra workout, work out extra long the next day. 
<laughs> Try to get all that grease out it of there. It was totally worth it. Anyways, it was. It was. Mm-hmm. Oh, man, it was so good. It was so good. But you can't do that all the time. You cannot. Okay? And, you know, mm-hmm. we're, we're all about living the freedom lifestyle. Ultimately, mm-hmm. you'll hear us talk about this. Of course, we want to grow this plumbing business. Mm-hmm. All right, but why are you growing this plumbing business? And, what you know, we want to create what we call the freedom lifestyle. Right. Look, you know. I'm sure that your dream is not to, you know, be doing plumbing and uh, ho- hope it's not your dream mm-hmm. and just owning this job and working and, oh, there's a job and plumbing, uh, yeah, whatever. Nice All right. We mm-hmm. want to live this other life. Okay. Mm-hmm. And so with life that we call the freedom lifestyle. Yes. And so when you we're living that freedom lifestyle, you want to, you know, have the energy, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. and, and vigor. <clears throat> Mm-hmm. You know, and you know we're older, all right. Hey, there's a comment. Nikki here. Do you have Do you have to already have a business up and running to start the course? My husband and I just started S Corp. He's planning to. Don't see the rest of it. Um, but um, the answer to that is no. Yeah. You don't have to already have a business up and running. That's no the question. In fact, we advise it would, you'd start out way ahead of guys. Um, that already running. Yes. This, this would be stuff that have right from the beginning would, would be wise for you. Yes. Um, you know? And so some of our um, clients or Success Academy members that are out there, you might want to um, right. respond to Nikki. Um, right. And Nikki, let us know where you're, you're from. What's the name of the business that you just started? We'd love to hear, hear that and support. Um, let's see. No, yeah. we just started our business and started the course at the same time. Amanda. All right, yep. Amanda. Um, is that Amanda that you addressed in um, the Success Academy comment? Yeah. Day? Was that? I can't remember. Well, was she um, and, and, and her husband, they're a plumbing power couple, mm-hmm. right? Yes. Okay. And, and they anyway. were part of what comes with the, the academy is uh, a couple live coaching classes um, every month, mm-hmm. uh, the first and third Wednesday. Of every month. Of every month. In fact, I think we have one coming up this. We right? have one Wednesday, yes, so where you're teaching. Where I'm teaching, live teaching on something mm-hmm. um, in, the, in the academy. And yes. then the last half of the class is open Q&A, which is usually the, the most popular time because mm-hmm. it gives you a chance to ask direct questions yes. um, to you know, to me or whoever mm-hmm. we have. Absolutely. Sometimes we bring in other experts and that kind of a thing. So, yes, but okay. we also have the Facebook group um, for the Success Academy members. Yes. So the answer to that is no, you don't have to have your business all up and running. It's it's great to start before. You'll start, get a leg up. You have, yes. Mm-hmm. Get a leg up on on all that. Okay, so, I wish, yeah. yeah. But yeah, let us know, Nikki, where um, in your business and, and where you're starting your business at. And congratulations. Yes. And way to go. And you can mm-hmm. do it. Yeah, mm-hmm. awesome. Good for you. Yeah, yeah. I don't know where to start. This would be a good investment to get. Absolutely. Definitely type success in the comments, Nikki, and you'll right. get a link um, that'll get you a 14-day free trial. Yep. Okay. Or go to themilliondollarplumber.com. Mm-hmm. Okay. The new website lays out even more information. We've mm-hmm. updated that kind of stuff. Yes. So give you more information. Mm-hmm. And, uh, yes, there is a 14-day free trial. Mm-hmm. Look, just make it we'll easy for you. The hook, yeah. We know once you're we'll there, you're you. in. You're in. <laughs> um, but it makes it easier for you to commit. Because yes. we had what we had someone we heard a, a testimonial. Someone gave us a testimonial. Mm-hmm. And I even made the statement, you know, you don't know if these guys, you know, if he's crazy yeah. or if he's for real. <laughs> 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 right. you know, and I understand that. I think the same way. You know, mm-hmm. and so I want to make it easy for you to say, okay, you know, is this check good it information? Out. Check mm-hmm. it out without having to totally commit. Right. Um, but the bottom line is, once once you're in, know you know, if you're, if you're serious it. about growing your business, mm-hmm. you know, you're in. Yes. So, so anyway, right. congratulations. Yes, Nikki, congratulations, and way to go to do it. All right, yes. stepping out. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, um, okay, so intentional life. Well, I live an intentional life, and so part of this is, um, you know, we, we build this this freedom lifestyle, a business that allows us to have the freedom lifestyle. Mm-hmm. Um, but then, you know, we, we've now we're drained or we're just, you know, we call it the fountain, you know, kind of jokingly the fountain youth. You know, mm-hmm. we're older and I don't know if this older is older than what? Well, you know, and I, a lot of people, <laughs> you know, we're, we're right at 60 and, oh. and, you know, and no, a lot of people two more years, right. we're, we're so far from right. 60. And a lot of people, you know, we were told, you know, how we've been asked, you know, how do you, well, you're not, you're not in the 50, you know, how, how do you stay, you know, you don't act your age. energetic, right? we don't, <laughs> that's part of, it. we don't act our age, which is important. Yeah. Okay. Mindset is we, we talk about this, even with growing your business, mm-hmm. I think it was Nikki, you know, we'll talk about, it's very, it's 80% of what you have up here. Okay. Yeah. Um, trash. Right. Mm-hmm. And so it's the same thing with, with, you know, living your life in this freedom lifestyle. Mm-hmm. So part of it, there is, a, there is a physical part of it. And we've talked about, you know, guys, we're big on working out. If you guys follow us, you know, online, you know, we do the morning workouts, which video we, in the morning video after, come out, working out. after we work out mm-hmm. and we, we work out every day. OK, mm-hmm. um, but there's also stuff that happens internally. OK, so that's what we want to want to talk about here. Okay. This is the mature content side of this. Yes. Yes. So I wanted to share, you know, guys, if you're feeling this kind of a thing, it happens when you hit about 30, okay? Mid-30s. Mid-30s. Mid-30, it really started, you know, mm-hmm. you know that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Where you, you find yourself starting to get tired about lunchtime, mm-hmm. and it's not just because you're hungry. 
Okay, <laughs> you know you're pitting on uh, weight. You know you work out, but you just can't can't lose the weight. Um, nor can you really put on muscle anymore. Um, you may find yourself in meetings. When I, I found myself in meetings, mm -hmm. and I, it, you know, other times, you know, before that I could hold, I could have four or five different you know, trails thoughts. or thoughts mm -hmm. that I was working on mm -hmm. while I'm in the meeting, mm -hmm. listening and still participating. Right. But now I found hard just to have one thought. <laughs> Hold one thought. <laughs> stay awake and have one right. thought. <laughs> and stay focused. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. And, of course, there's the you know, libido side of things. Mm -hmm. And we're not going to make this about sex, but it does mean it, we, we are affected there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sure. You know, so what, you know, in fact, our final straw. So there was a period of my time. I waited too long. It hit yeah, me in my, my 40s. Yeah, it was in your 40s. And it was just, you know, I was, I was working out, but I, again, I couldn't lose the weight. Mm -hmm. I really wasn't putting on anything. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I, I couldn't muscle, hold the, you mean. right muscle, right. right. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I was still staying soft. You know, mm -hmm. um, couldn't, um, you know, hold the thoughts. Mm -hmm. And I was tired by one o'clock. You know, I was yeah. done. Mm -hmm. You know, it was like I needed a nap. Yeah. And it didn't matter what time you just I was more lethargic. I would right, say. Right. Right. Yeah. That kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. And the final straw is we were getting ready to go on a go on a trip. Mm -hmm. I'll share this because it is kind of. Oh, comical me. but we're getting ready to go on a trip uh, like the, you know we like to go to caribbean mm -hmm. and that kind of stuff and i think we're getting ready to go to jamaica mm -hmm. so okay. the lovely laura was picking out a new suit new swimsuit mm -hmm. you know something you know nice for the trip right okay okay mm -hmm. and so she was looking through a catalog and she brought me over back when they had catalogs when you're looking through right looking through <laughs> right and going going through it and showing you know all these and you know trying to pick out a, a suit Okay, mm -hmm. and then finally, you know, she apologized to me. Oh, sweetheart, I'm sorry. Cause you know, to me, you know, mm -hmm. you, you know, it's all these models, mm -hmm. swimsuit models, and you know mm -hmm. that kind of stuff. And you know, we're careful about that in our, you know, in our relationship. In our relationship. Mm -hmm. And it, it hit me. <laughs> I didn't notice one model. <laughs> I'm, if you know guys, if you know what I'm saying, okay. <laughs> but I did notice the little bows. And the polka dots, <laughs> and, the, and the colors of the suits, and how to, <laughs> that kind of thing. You know, Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> I'm not firing on all cylinders. Okay, so I, I took it to you know this this kind of thing. First on uh, the not, not being able to lose weight, and, and I had, we had a pastor in our church. Um, that was a big. I mean, the guy played for Oklahoma football. football. You know, mm -hmm. uh, it, yeah, um, university. university, whatever. Got got hurt, and then he was, did a strong man. I mean, the guy's built. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm big. Yeah. And you know, so I was asking about what what I could do, you know, to work out, and we had that conversation. But he said he sent me to this guy in town. Mm -hmm. Um, that turned out to be a guy that was ex Air Force and a bodybuilder. Mm -hmm. The guy um, did the nutrition program for the Air Force. Okay. So he designed the nutrition and workout mm -hmm. and stuff for for the Air Force. Okay. For the Air Force, the whole I know, right. Right. And he started his own um, Nutri nutrition store. Nutrition store, and, and he was yeah. just a straight talker. He didn't know, try to oversell you stuff or mm -hmm. stuff you didn't need. So I his go. Name in, was Bob. Name was Bob. Mm -hmm. and so I go in there, and you know, Bob. we walk in there together. Yes. In fact, this was a. A Saturday, mm -hmm. okay. Um, was it? Yeah. Because we walked okay. in the garden, yeah, yeah, right? Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. So I walk in together and just there with Bob, and I'm telling him, I'm, you know, about what I'm, you know, I can't lose the weight and what I'm going through. Mm -hmm. And it's foggy Bob, and foggy. just so, all your symptoms. So right? Bob, this bodybuilder, and this guy's <laughs> in his 60s. Mm -hmm. Another guy looks younger. Yeah. Looks good, good mm -hmm. shape. Mm -hmm. If you know what I'm saying, you know, mm -hmm. still in really good shape mm -hmm. and energy and that kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. So he starts asking me questions. You know, um, you know, do you ever? Um, you know, you know how how's your? Uh, he went right to it. Mm -hmm. You know, how's your libido? How's your libido? Mm -hmm. Well, you know, I told him my story. <laughs> mm -hmm. He just kind of laughed, mm -hmm. and then he asked me, "Well, do you ever get weepy?" <laughs> so I, you know, I kind of looked at the lovely Laura like, <laughs> "We're not going to talk about you know this," but I, I said, well, yeah. Because I did find myself, you, know, you watch these commercials, guys, you know, the show the kids or your young kid. It brought memories of my kids when they were young, and I'd find myself just getting a little, you know, what? You know, a little, I had a commercial, okay? And he goes, okay, yeah, that, that's normal. Hallmark gets okay, it every time. Right. And so he was asking me those kinds of questions. It was very uncomfortable. And finally he said, look, here's the issue. Mm -hmm. You have low T. I mm -hmm. said, low what? Low what? You have low T, low, mm -hmm. low, low testosterone. 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 Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. which, which is common among men. And he explained how that's, he was going to a low T center and mm -hmm. getting T shots. Mm -hmm. And, you know, that, how that, that got his, his mind back, mm -hmm. you know, his energy, energy back. Because yes. um, the um, oomph and his step. Right. Vitality. Yeah, mm -hmm. you know, that, that, that kind of thing came back. Right. 
And so before we got out of there, we didn't make it out of the door. And the lovely Laura had me booked first thing Monday morning at the little tea center. <laughs> yeah, you're going. <laughs> so I go in, I go into the little tea center, you know, that, that morning, you know, and the, and the little girl nurse <laughs> to ask me all these questions. Guys, it, is un, it can be a little weird uncomfortable, or uncomfortable, sure. right, mm. you know. But, you know, the doc does come in, you know, they draw blood and that kind of stuff. Yes. Okay. Yes. Doc comes in and talks to you. Yes. You know. And, okay, well, I mean, and there's a reason why you go to a men's clinic as yeah. opposed to um, a family doctor. Yeah. We, um, but we're certainly not doctors. We're not doctors. Nor do we play one, you know, on, on a blog. <laughs> on YouTube. On YouTube. Or or, right. That right. kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. But we highly recommend you going to a men's health clinic. A specialized area. Right. And, so you know, low T deals. center that because right. your regular family doctor is not about yeah. men's well, health. Well, they're not trained. I right. Mean, they, they're not. Right. Yeah. So um, right. finding some place that does, you know, bioidentical or any type of right. um, men's specialty. So, yes. Well, it turns out. Um, <laughs> got, got my, my tea just no longer. And it was only, oh, 360 cannot afford. Oh, well, mm. you need for, you know, you need to put it. BV, I'm pretty sure you're in the Success Academy. You need to put that in your honest hourly rate. Right. Who pays for that? Who pays for your tea? Too. Your customers pay for your tea because it's important that you're healthy, okay? Because yes. it's important for business, okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. So, but finally, I did my testing and uh, VJ, mm -hmm. and it came back mm -hmm. basically I was a girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was a girl. Uh, mine was 120, mm -hmm. and they, they measure two different ways. Um, by the way, this rate, you know, uh, a teenage boy, you know, in our, in our prime or whatever, you know, we're, we're cooking at about, a, you know, 1,100, 1,200. Mm -hmm. That's why, we're, you know, it's raging hormones, okay? Right. <laughs> and that's why guys can stay slim and just go, mm -hmm. you know, they can party all night or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Right. Um, 11, 1,200, okay? <laughs> I was 120, okay? <laughs> you know, and there's another section. Um, it, there's where you measure something else. Measure, right, you're free or something like that where normally a good is around, you know, 24, 25. Mm -hmm. They gave me a point. Five just to be nice. <laughs> so I was basically that, was, which explained yes. a lot. Okay, yes. mm -hmm. and my estrogen was high. What happens, guys? You hear about grumpy old men. Mm. You know, about really what's happening is that they've lost their tea, and our estrogen kicks in. Mm. And you know how estrogen can affect women. You know, making them moody or whatever. Mm -hmm. Well, it's bad for guys. Right. So the the lie is that tea makes you you know raging. Mm -hmm. No, the tea settles you out right it's the estrogen that makes men right. go crazy mm -hmm. okay yes so basically i you know got, got on the program mm -hmm. and within uh, two weeks of um, within, the program, within yeah you you were i was yourself. coming back right yeah you were almost yourself again right and within a month yeah you were Doing, like doing you're in great. your 30s. Right. Mm -hmm. And to this day, I, I take, you know, I give myself shots now. Yes. And do it. In fact, I just under did. Doc, just under did doctor's you. care. Yep. Mm -hmm. Under yes. doctor's care. Um, but, yes, it, yep. it totally changed our lives. Right. Uh, it brought you back. Yes. Yes. So that's why we wanted to talk about it is because it is it's important. It's like, what does this have to do with plumbing business? Right. It right. has everything to do because, again, we, we're, we want to focus on freedom lifestyle. What kind of lifestyle do you want? Well, if you're tired and sluggish and no energy and no oomph in your step, you know, what, what kind of freedom lifestyle is that? Right. right. Um, so it's, it's the whole um, the whole package. Right. And the idea of being intentional about it. I mean, yes. as guys, we think, well, this is just. You know, we're not talking about, you know, that you got to be, be a body, you know, no. get into bodybuilding and that kind no, of, no, that's no, not no. what it is. We're just mm. talking about the energy. Right. Okay. And, mm. and, and enjoying life and, and having focus. Right. You know? Yes. And you know, mm. guys the best treatment on the local place says the bio life insert pellets. There's both. Um, right. Yeah. There's, there's places that do pellets. And I, I did the pellets um, a couple times. Mm. I, I prefer the shots. Yeah. Um, the, the pellets, I just didn't like. Because of the, the amount that they would give me, you know, it was a bigger, bigger pellet, mm -hmm. and it was sore for longer yeah, or whatever. Yeah. Um, so yeah. I would search for someplace else, just a, a men's clinic. Or the one you went to, Low T Center, that's a nationwide place. Right. Low T Center um, is always a great place. And like, if you have to travel to go get tested, and which is, you know, if you have to go an hour or so away, um, they can set you up to where you take the shots at home as well. Right. You just go and get tested once a quarter, I think, is when you do the blood. Yep. Is that right? So, right. Possibility and there's well. all kinds. I mean, it's just anything. I mean, they, they test you. They, they check your, your, your prostate, prostate. Mm -hmm. you know, that kind of a thing. You know, and it's, you know, I remember having a conversation with a couple old guys, you know, when they heard, you know, some other guys, some guys were talking about they were getting tea and mm -hmm. I couldn't, I was working out, I was in the gym and, mm -hmm. and a couple old guys said, well, no, it'll, you know, cause prostate cancer. Well, 
you're barely alive. First of all, there's a reason why you, you know, and it, there, there's a lot of fears that kind of, you know, mm-hmm. if you, as long as you're under doctor supervision, right? I mean, it doesn't, doesn't cause, right. if anything, it's, you know, because it helps you grow mm-hmm. and, and the prostate is something that grows with men, you know, mm-hmm. um, it, it can accelerate if you already have an issue. Mm-hmm. So if you already have a prostate issue, they won't right. allow, they won't give oh, yeah, you, they won't because you testosterone is a growing thing. I mean, it, you know, right. And so they won't even give it to you. But they do monitor that because that is something that's always, you know, a concern for us men as we get older. Any age, but um, certainly as we get older. Mm. But, you know, it's this kind of a thing is, well, I don't need that. That's silly. I mean, I've heard guys say, well, it's, Mm. you know, I'm not going to do that. We've had, you know, or whatever. But yet they barely, you know, they complain about their aches and pains Mm -hmm. and and they, you know, don't have the energy and always tired, but they're not going to do anything. Right. And and Mm. that kind of a thing. Okay. Mm. Um, so, you know, it can be a stigma or, you know, our attitude mm-hmm. on how we look at things. But, you know, truly what we're about here with Million, Million Dollar Plumber is not only growing a successful business, but having a successful life, you know, and a life mm-hmm. that, that um, gives you, you know, energy. Right. Yeah. And, you have energy to live. Right. To do the things you want to do. And do you want to live like everybody else? Right. So you, you right. want to be 50 and already, you know, planning on your funeral? Right. You know, or, or you, you know, yeah, that kind of. 45 where you just feel like life is over. Right. It doesn't, have to, at, right. it doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be. And and we know how you know, especially yeah. how how it feels because right. you were there, and right. now you know the difference. So right. I mean, I I feel I can take anyone on and anything on, and the best <laughs> is yet to come. Mm-hmm. Now, there's you know, there's a reality to my age is that you know I can't, but I am doing. I mean, I I lift now more in some areas than, mm-hmm. than I ever did when I was a young man. Right. You know, mm-hmm. but am I ever going to be able to do the same things as, as a young man? No, that's not necessarily what this is all about. It's about right. how, how we feel. Right. But I have the energy to mm-hmm. do these things. Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. And, and, the, and the vigor. The vigor. The vigor. Oomph in your step. Right. Mm-hmm. You know, and that makes for a great life. Mm-hmm. Okay. And that's why you, you're, you're creating this plumbing business. Okay. Not to, again, not just to have a job, right. but it's creating this life, which is very important. Mm-hmm. You know? Yes. Again, so. the intentional life. Living the intentional life. You got to right. be intentional about your about your health because it sure is easy to let it be on the back burner. Yes, that's very easy to do. Right. Um, okay. Because it's it takes it takes energy. Right. It takes energy to, you know, to being, focus on your your health. You know, and something kind of silly. You know, it is. You know, going in talking about I want you know tea. Mm-hmm. You know to. You know. If anything, just I mean, if you are feeling that way, go and get it checked out. Just so you know, right. just so you know, you know, kind of baseline. Maybe you're mid thirties and you think, well, maybe you don't need it yet or whatever. Um, I've been using a tea topical cream for a week. Good for you, Ted. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, a good place to stop. Yeah. To start. Yeah. Start. Well, mm-hmm. yeah. And there's other things going on there, I think. But mm-hmm. um, but that's a great place. Um, the, the topical is not as strong, mm-hmm. you know, as, you know, the having it injected or mm-hmmm. the, the pellet, mm-hmm. that kind of a thing. But but it's good, yes. you know. Start somewhere. Yeah. But, again, just maybe go get checked out and see, see where your levels are. I may answer some questions, like if you're feeling like why am i so tired or why do i feel like i don't i don't feel like me or right. whatever that it might be that and it doesn't have to be that way mm-hmm. you know so right you know mm-hmm. and i know and also that we've done you know the lovely laura yes takes tea i do take tea mm-hmm. you know which is under doctor's care right yes and i do the pellets as well but um yeah for you for d- women it's also energy right um and no it doesn't make you um bulk up obviously i got the boniest arms right. um, i wish it did I like just it. a little bit <laughs> but sadly it does not um but i go to a place where they really check all kind of the whole holistic everything um bioidentical hormones um and the reason i did that is because mid 40s i felt like i was a crazy person my emotions were all over the place up and down and just one day i'd be not even one right. day one hour i'd be the screaming lunatic the next i'd be crying the next i'm happy as can be or whatever <laughs> don't agree so much okay. um and so i finally i'm not um, saying anything <laughs> finally went and got um me checked out not obviously to a men's clinic but to a place that does bioidentical hormones and got tested and on supplements and things to make me feel like me again and i'm not a raging crazy person any longer right at least not on a regular basis <laughs> exactly <laughs> right no it's great mm-hmm. and, and we have a great life yes angel is mm-hmm. why it will change your life that's right ask, hi angel fact, ask ron blevins in fact we met ron ron and i <laughs> from the same city <laughs> and um we ran into each other a couple times we passed each other at the tea place at the tea place mm-hmm. all right next <laughs> right. all your right turn.
Okay. Mm-hmm. You so know, left cheek, right cheek. <laughs> left cheek, right cheek. <laughs> so I know right. this is a weird topic for Potty Talk Live and plumbing business and all that, but again, freedom lifestyle. And yes. so learning from the things that, that we um, have done or haven't done, we wish we would have started all of that years before right. we did. Years. Um, I would have started started in my thirties. Yes, absolutely. Right. Yeah, and I, I definitely would as well. Yeah. So, recommend take take control of your life, take control of your health. You're right. the only one that can do it. Right. It, it 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 doesn't have to be where this is just now how I feel. Right. This this is life. It's, right. Because we're getting older. And so sadly, that's how what it is when you get older and right. Doesn't have to be that way. Right. Mm-hmm. So. And so is that it? There we go. Anything else you have to say about that? We just, that's what we're all up? about here. Man, there's so many things. Man, if we would have done okay. half the things that we now tell people or share at with people age, at an earlier age, I mean, I know. we would have been so Less much stupid. better. <laughs> 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 so there, take I advantage know. of our mistakes, okay? Listen to us. All right. Help us help, help you. you. Right. <laughs> that is all right. Problem. So do it. Guys, get checked out, mm-hmm. Okay. And it, it is fun. Mm-hmm. Okay? Yes. Yes. We just feel better. There we go. All right. Okay. So, live the, um, oh. So there we go. Live okay. the intentional life. All right. And look, yeah. Shelby made it through the whole show. Nothing crashed. All Ms. right. Shelby, congratulations, Miss Shelby. Um, yeah, piece of cake. So I bet we don't even have to be here next time. She can just there we go. put up some holograms or something. Right. It'll be grand. <laughs> Hey, it was great having you here. Mm-hmm. Hey, but before uh, we let you go here, I mm-hmm. just want to um, um, share the Success Academy. We brought it up here. Yeah. All right. Mm-hmm. Million Dollar Plumber. <laughs>